Hello boys and girls and welcome to DCS World 1.5 where I am flying the Warthog. The Mighty Hog. The plane after which the joystick I use is named. Uh, it's gorgeous. As is 1.5 in DCS World. It's freaking gorgeous. I mean look at it. The graphics are awesome. Massive upgrade. Uh, anyway, I'm here with a bit of an update on things. Um, and while I do that I'm gonna completely wreck this train on my camera here so yeah things um, have been a bit weird lately um, lots of real life stuff getting in the way of YouTube uh, that's mainly why I haven't been uploading a lot lately um, plus I've had a lot of hardware issues um, I had this problem which some of you will be aware of by now, whereby I um, had to buy some, some new headphones, which, unfortunately, because they were USB ones, they buggered up my computer, and it meant that I couldn't record anything with sound anymore, um, for some reason. I don't really know how that works still, so I had to go get another pair, which were, um, you know, used a standard audio jack like my old ones, and so on and so on. And, you know, just, just to be honest, it's been a massive pain in the, in the dick, uh, the whole thing. And because I've just got other real-life stuff going on at the minute, I don't really want to go into it too much. Um, I really, really don't. I'll be here all day if I do, and, you know, anyway. But I haven't had a lot of spare time to devote to YouTube anyway. Um, the time, free time I've had that I have decided to share with you guys has mostly been doing Twitch streams, which, I have to be honest, I've been enjoying a lot um, whenever I've been able to get around to doing them. Uh, I genuinely, at the moment, I'm enjoying streaming more than I am making videos. It just It's way less effort on my end, and I know that sounds really lazy of me, because it kind of is. But also, it's just a much better way of interacting with you guys, because, you know, I mean, I actually get to talk to you. I mean, I'll, yeah, okay, it's via Twitch chat, but it's still way better than YouTube comments. I can't stand YouTube comments. They've never been... They've never been very good. They never will be very good. Um... They make everyone, every, anyone who, who types in YouTube comments, you know, can can look like an idiot sometimes, even though they're absolutely, absolutely not. And just they're way too, I, I get way too easily annoyed by them and stuff like that. And I, I've stopped short of just completely disabling them, to be honest, because it would just piss people off, because they're very precious about it for some reason. Um, but I can't stand YouTube comments. I don't really read them very much anymore these days. Um, and whenever I do, I kind of regret doing it, to be honest. So that's why I've been like, enjoying Twitch, to be honest with you, because it has been a better way to interact with you guys, um, much better. Because we can actually get a dialogue going, and we can actually converse in some form or another, and, you know, just slightly more casually enjoy games and stuff. It's just, it's, it's been good, um, is what I'm saying. So I'm, I kind of want to do more of that in the future, but anyway, so, where was I going with this? Uh, yeah, basically, things have been very quiet on the channel lately, and that is the reason why. People keep badgering me, asking me, Oh, is X, Y, Z series over? Is it done? Look, here's the rules on this channel, and I've explained this many times before, but apparently I need to do it again. Unless I post an actual video saying, This series is done, forget about it, it's not done. I'm having a break from it, I'm doing whatever, I've just not been in the mood to play it, it doesn't matter, it's not officially done until I say it's done. Uh, so, are we clear? Good. So you can stop asking me, is Skyrim finished? Is Fallout New Vegas finished? Have I said it's finished? No, therefore it's not finished. You know, there's a little, nice little flowchart you can you can put together using that. Um, it's very simple. So, yeah. That's, it. nothing, nothing's, nothing's the matter, nothing's wrong. I've just had a very, very little time recently. And unfortunately, you know, you guys have been massively generous. You know who you are, the guys on Patreon. And I'm gutted, to be honest with you, because I've not been able to put any of this money into anything actually goddamn useful, because I've just had to replace broken stuff, and, and honestly, just pay bills. Um, I make no bones about that, you know. I, I, can't, I can't promise to put every ounce of Patreon money I get into investing in new stuff for the channel, because ultimately, you know, things like bills um, and rent and, th and stuff like that, they come first. They really do. Because and no, not through any choice of mine. It's simply because I, I need the, need to pay them in order to live. Um, so you know, it's just one of those things. Um, nothing I can do about it. 
but in the future hopefully when I you know when things are a bit more stable at my end we can start investing in some cool shit I have just got you know sometimes you get one of those times in your, in your life where everything breaks at once recently has been one of those times um, my, my flight sim stuff has kind of all just broken at once my chair needs replacing my fucking one of my monitors really needs replacing in fact I need to get a third monitor to be completely honest with you um, that sounds insane I know three monitors who needs three monitors people who use YouTube and Twitch need three monitors that's who um, and to be honest with you, I need another PC at some point just to be able to stream and, and render footage with and stuff. Really, and that'll, that'll involve getting a capture card and... Oh, God. Anyway, yeah, it's expensive stuff. And that's that's when you don't factor in all the regular real-life bollocks like bills. Um, so... Yeah. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Anyway, so... Moving on to the main big point of this video, I suppose, in my usual rambling fashion, um, I've made a bit of a decision, um, and that is that I am going to start a second channel. Um, I've been thinking about this for a while now, and just some recent stuff has really kind of pushed me over the edge in that regard, and made me think, you know what, I need to do this. Um, I'm starting a second channel because um, I want a channel, a separate one, to be able to put all my simulator stuff on. Uh, I really do. I, I don't want to be constantly in this position where I want to play simulator stuff, the hardcore simulator stuff. Um, I want to record it, I want to upload it, but what I don't want to have to put up with is every time I do it, a million comments saying, what about Skyrim? Or what about Fallout? Dave, where's Fallout? What happened to Fallout? What happened to Skyrim, Dave? Why aren't you, do why aren't you doing Skyrim? This is boring. This is you're such a nerd. Why aren't you playing Skyrim, a, a game involving pretend dragons and you know, running around in a magic tiki mask? I might add, but hey, you know, some people's definition of nerd is different from others. What can I say? Um, so, yeah, that's that's kind of the conclusion I've come to. I know a lot of you watching the my my videos do enjoy this stuff. I've had people who come to my channel and even my Twitch streams because I was doing this stuff and not because of any of my other stuff. They, they weren't even aware that I did Skyrim or Fallout videos. And to, so to me at the minute, to be honest with you, the, the most sensible course of action really is to, to set, start up a second channel. Um, and on that will be all my sim stuff um, and historical stuff and whatever. So that that means uh, the, the ACG campaign stuff will go on there. Um, I, other IL2 stuff will go on there, Rise of Flight will go on there, um, DCS World you're seeing here, which I've done barely any of on the channel, but this will be going on there, um, my P3D slash FSX stuff will be going on there, Euro Truck will go on there, um, Silent Hunter will go on there, Silent Hunter may well end up being the, the sort of maiden series for that channel actually as well, by the way, for those of you like your, your World War II submarine, that is coming, and it will probably be the first thing on that channel. One of the first things, anyway. Um, and so the rest of you who enjoy the, the RPGs, the slightly more casual stuff um, that I put up on the main channel, you guys can keep subscribed to that and you will never be bothered again by my aeroplane nonsense. And for those of you that enjoy the aeroplane nonsense, you can subscribe specifically for that or you can subscribe to both if you want to get everything. It's really up to you. Um, what can I say? I mean, air, sim, the sim stuff, um, specifically the aeroplane stuff, really more than anything else, is a, it's become a bigger part of my life uh, these days over the years. It's become a bigger part of my gaming habits. And things like The Elder Scrolls and Fallout have become a much smaller part of my gaming habits. Um, one has waxed while the other has waned, let's put it that way. Uh, and that's just the way things are. People's um, people's preferences and you know and and gaming habits. I've used that phrase three times now, and I don't like repeating myself, but whatever. They mature and change as as time goes on. They simply do. Um, I don't. It's not that I don't enjoy playing my RPGs and stuff. I absolutely do. I just don't play them or enjoy them quite as much as I used to. It's just one of those things. Um, to take another example, I used to absolutely love the Total War games, and I played the shit out of them for years. I modded them, I did all sorts of things, I, I was part of a huge modding team um, at one point. 
and I made a bunch of my own little mods, um, most of which, sadly, in case anyone's curious, you probably can't find anymore. I think the download links for them are all dead, and they're all buried in forum threads somewhere on various websites, but I did make mods. And then just somewhere along the line, I got bored of Total War. I did. I just got bored of it, and I stopped playing it. And that applied to the older games as well as the new ones that keep coming out, like, you know, Shogun 2 and uh, Rome 2 and Attila. Uh, you know, I've tried them. I usually buy a new Total War game whenever one comes out, and I play it for maybe half an hour, and I just think, Ugh, it's not doing it for me anymore. I just don't like it. And it's one of those things. I, I'm getting there with, with my RPGs and stuff, which, you know, which is what I kind of originally began with on this channel. Well, that's... It's not strictly speaking true. I mean, this is something I always point out when, you know, people are like, oh, but you're an Elder Scrolls RPG channel. You can't have a go at people for wanting to know where that is. And it's like, well, no, I'm not, actually. I started off by showcasing a mod, um, Mara Oblivion, which was not a very good series, if I'm completely honest with you. It just got a lot of hits because no one, well, very few people had actually done anything to do with Mara Oblivion at that point. Um... And that, that's that. But the, the first real proper series, proper Let's Play, if you really want to call it that, I actually did, was, was Hearts of Iron 2. It was Kaiserreich. It was Kaiserreich is Russia. That was my first actual series, and I think it's the first one I actually finished as well. So, you know, um, to, you know, to be honest with you, and there was a point, actually, where that was getting me more views than any of my Elder Scrolls RPG stuff was. It, 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 it was much bigger. Um than that was. That's why I have three series of Kaiserreich on the channel. I have the I have the Russia one, I have the, the American one, which was unfortunately ended because the uh, I don't know, I kept getting a repeated crash at a certain date in the game, which basically ruined it um, which was a shame and I'm still kind of gutted about that because it was a really good campaign, but I have that, the, Ameri the American one and, and, the, and the German one, which I did slightly more recently. Um, there are three series of that on my channel because for ages it was the most popular thing. Um, so, anyway. I'm babbling. I know, I'm babbling, I'm rambling, you guys should be used to it by now, whatever, anyway, that's that's what's going to happen, a uh, new channel's going to be started, and, you know, I have to warn you, in all fairness, at least to begin with, it will be getting more attention than my main channel, it, it will, um, both because it's a new thing and I want to get it set up properly, and also because that at the moment is what I spend most of my time on that kind of area type of games or whatever you want to call it that's what I spend most of my time doing and therefore my content is going to reflect that um, and therefore you'll see a lot more videos of that on the other channel for a while um, I'm not saying it's going to be like that forever I'm, I'm certainly when Fallout 4 comes out I will probably start getting my um, I'll probably start getting my whole Fallout RPG thing back on um, it will be nice to play something brand new again for a change, instead of just retreading old ground. Just heavily modded, um, which is an issue. I think it's one of the contributing factors to me getting bored with those series, is the fact that I'm just playing stuff I've played a million times before. Um, so that'll be good, I'm sure. Uh, you won't probably see a series of it immediately from me. You will almost certainly see me stream it on Twitch every now and again, for sure. Um, because I will, I will probably start playing it by myself, and then get to a point where I'm like, right, I want to share this with the others, um, and I will start streaming it. But yeah, you won't see a full-on series of it for quite some time. Um, it was the same with Skyrim. I waited until there were a lot, all, you know, all the patches and expansions were out, and all the decent mods were out. Then I, then I began a series of it, and I'm sure the same will be true of Fallout 4. If Fallout 4 is any good, of course, it probably won't be awful, but we'll see. It remains to be seen whether I like it a terrific amount, because um, Bethesda's last attempt at a Fallout game, Fallout 3, I did enjoy, but not so much that I kept coming back for more. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. That's a whole to other topic for a whole other time in a whole other vi video, though, but I'm, I, I'm almost sure half the comments on this video will now be about that, so whatever. But anyway... Um, yeah, that's that really. Um, so yeah, new channel, everybody. New channel. Um, it's not the end of the world, though. Don't panic. Vegas and Skyrim will continue, as will Morrowind. Um, for those who are unaware, New Vegas Bounties 3 for New Vegas. 
New Vegas bounties three for New Vegas. Did I actually just say that? Never mind. Um, it's out anyway. Some guy two thousand finally finished it, um, and that's really cool. I didn't think it was ever going to come out to be honest with you, and I was fine with that. I might add, but um, still, it's pretty cool to know that that's that's out in the open in the wild. And I'll probably be adding it to the list of stuff we play in the New Vegas Let's Play. And yeah, I have to admit, knowing that that is there is giving me a fresh little burst of inspiration when it comes to playing New Vegas. Um, I'm, it's really cool. I know I'll be able to finish that whole little storyline, but yeah. So, but yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah. For now, new channel, new sim stuff, new channel in an environment where I can I can go full flight simulation, truck simulation, nerd mode, and not feel like I'm gonna get my balls busted for not doing Skyrim or Fallout instead. I mean, probably there will be, there will almost certainly, obviously, I'm aware of this, there, are, there will almost certainly people who come across from the main channel going, why are you doing this instead of Skyrim? And those people will get, you know, told to STFU or, or banned or whatever, you know. Um, I will deal with that. But for the vast majority of sensible people, um, it shouldn't be a problem, I hope. So, yeah. Um, and that's that's it really. Uh, the the only real thing is, I guess, is I haven't quite thought of a name for the other channel yet. Um, I'm I'm coming up with a bit of a creative blank here. Um, so in the interim between now and me actually having set it up, um, now would be a good time for suggestions, I suppose, within reason. Suggest anything completely stupid because you know I won't use it, so don't bother. Um, but yeah, a few name suggestions for the new channel would be nice. I've got a couple of uh, slightly weak source ideas um, of my own, but it'd be nice to to tap into the hive mind a bit and <laughs> see what it comes up with. <laughs> um, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. And now I'm gonna blow the fuck out of this train. So. Um, Round this way. Round this way. You're gonna get gowed, motherfucker. Where are you? Where? Where the fuck actually is it? Seriously. I think it's off to my right somewhere. Um. There it is. Got it. Okay. Yep. Camera's pointing straight at it. Awesome. Right, here we go. Altitude. Altitude. Yeah, shut up, Betty. Full throttle. Let's do this. I'd like to actually come in along so we can hit it from a stern. Get a lot more hits in that way. Pull up. Pull up. Right, here we go. Sweet! Gotta love the Gow 8. The most badass gun in the world, if I'm being totally honest. Yep. Uh, whoa. How, why can I not zoom in? Actually being trolled by the game. There we go, that's better. Whew. Correct. Yeah. Stick that one in your pipe and smoke it, Putin. Anyway, so <laughs> with that on that bombshell, in a sense, um, ladies and gentlemen, that's it from me. Thank you for watching this little update video. If you made it this far, you were rewarded with an exploding train. I hope you. Uh, I hope you're satisfied. So anyway, yeah, that's it. I'll see you again soon, I'll get recording some more videos, normal service will resume, I'm just having a bit of a hectic time at the minute and hopefully you guys can appreciate that, and like I said, I'm, I'm not going to go into too many specifics because they're mostly boring and uh, it would take a while to explain. Just suffice to say, stuff is happening and I'm dealing with it, and um, it will be for, for the betterment of this channel once it's dealt with, so yeah. I'm going to stop talking now. Bye-bye.